WTFNN. Headline news update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, 3rd a.m. Thursday morning, 30 minutes to go until the opening bell, and we got markets trading to the positive on a little bit of trade news. Dow Jones right now up 142 points in the futures, trading 27,572. S&Ps positive by 10, trading at 3,085. NASDAQ futures positive by 30 points, trading at 8,237. Oil catching a bit as well, up 85 cents at 57.20. Ten-year yield up a bit as well. Ten-year sitting at 1.879%. You see the spike on the S&Ps. We'll go over the news in a moment. 2 a.m. Eastern time, you see the S&Ps spike from about 3,076, reaching a high of 3,092. Just by 3 a.m. Eastern time, off those levels just a bit at 3,086. Jumping over to the VIX, as we start things off, you see the inverse, basically, of the market action. The VIX trading all the way down to a low of, where are we at? 1243 on that VIX, currently sitting 1256. Start things off, and we'll jump over to the story of the day. And there it is. China says it has agreed with the U.S. to cancel existing trade tariffs in phases. Be skeptical of what you're reading here, though. One important condition for a limited trade agreement, and this is China's Commerce Ministry, a spokesman, excuse me, for the China's, China's Commerce Ministry, Gao Fang, said that both sides had agreed to simultaneous, simultaneously cancel some existing tariffs on one another's goods when the U.S. and China must remove the same amount of charges. We got our man Larry Pesvento coming up at 9 a.m., he was just posting in the Tiger's Den, getting ready for his program. I love this graphic. Check that out. This is a headline from Bloomberg. China says U.S. agreed to tariff rollback if deal is reached. Be skeptical, folks. Just a headline out there from China. We'll see if that becomes a reality. Jumping back to the charts, we'll start it off with the Dow 30. There's your acceleration to higher prices, currently sitting 27,574. NASDAQ 100, trading at 82.39, just off the highs as well. We covered the S&P 500 futures, trading at 3,086. There's your crude oil market, trading higher as well, $57.26. Gold contract, pulling back a bit on that news. Gold trading at 14.85, and the Euro US dollar trading at 110.67. As we wrap it up, it is still earnings season. Tonight, we get Disney after the bell. Disney looking to trade a bit higher in the pre-market, 132.25 right now, closed yesterday at 131.27. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pesavento coming up right now. I'll be back at 10 o'clock with Tom. I'll be right back.